what's in the bag gym version. And I know golfers, we love to show our clubs in our bag, but today I'm gonna to show you what I put in my gym bag. So before I show you all the stuff that I have that I bring to the gym with me, I'll just let you know I'm not affiliated by any of these brands. I'm not, I don't have a code, I don't make money off of them, um, have no partnership with them whatsoever. So these are just brands I like to use um, and I'm gonna show you what I have. So um, the basics, right? Headphones, but something I have in here that maybe not everyone has, and that's a mouthpiece. So you can get any kind of mouthpiece, but I went to the dentist years ago and they told me that I was just grinding the shit out of my teeth and I had to do something about it. So I wear a night, night guard at night, but also in the gym, I wear a mouthpiece. Hopefully I clean this. I did clean it, haha. <laughs> uh, but this is the mouthpiece I wear. It's from Airwave. And you can just go to like any sporting goods store, get one that maybe you wore in football or something like that, and it would work. But this one's pretty cool. I'm gonna put it in my mouth. And it's got this gap in between so you can still breathe pretty well. Um, but I love this. They even have some studies out. Um, I think it was a Major League Baseball pitcher put one of these in, clinched down their teeth really hard, and they were able to add like a couple miles per hour to their fastball. So not only is this to protect your teeth, but there are some performance benefits to having a mouthpiece. Um, it's something I wear every single workout. Um, I usually, I will take it out when I do cardio, um, like zone two cardio or something like that. But if I'm doing a hit workout or if I'm lifting heavy, I definitely have this mouthpiece in. So not everyone has these, this is from Airwave. Um, really, really great product. So another thing that a lot of people probably don't have when it comes to things you wear, and that's gonna be Breathe Right strips. So nothing fancy about these. Again, like I don't have like a crazy brand that I work with, but just your good old fashioned Breathe Right strips, put them on the bridge of your nose, open up your nostrils a little bit, open up your airways, you can breathe easier. So when I first started wearing these, I was doing some zone two cardio on the Stairmaster, and I was able to go up two whole levels and go five minutes longer than I had my previous session just by wearing one of these. And it stayed on, I got super sweaty, and it still worked. So, a couple things that you probably won't see in most people's bags right there. Next up, towel, and then grips. So these are Versa grips, and I've literally had these for over 10 years. You can tell how worn they were. I think the original color was orange, and I don't know what color that is now, but I don't think it's really orange. They're worn, but they still work great. So. I use these for deadlifts, pull-ups, rows. I used to use them for flies. I don't really do a lot of you know, lateral, uh, lateral raises, excuse me. I don't really do a ton of those anymore, but they work for that as well. Um, a band. So a lot of gyms will have these bands, but some don't. Like my gym has like the um, thicker like cloth, like, um, like booty bands. And I think these are much easier to use. So I like these, you can put them over your shoes and everything as well. So you get a lot out of these type of bands, um, but I always bring a couple of these in my bag and I've even given away a few of these here. So um, I'm running a little low, but these bands. So um, that's just a few of the things that I have in my bag. And then last, we'll talk about supplementation. So um, I like to put my supplements, this is just creatine and a little bit of BCAAs for some flavor. Um, I'm cutting right now, so I don't need the extra calories of like adding in a carbohydrate drink, which I will um, probably like in season, you know, when I'm trying to not cut. Um, but when I have my water bottle, which I think I left it sitting over there, but my water bottle has just water in it right now. I drink my pre-workout. I started drinking it like an hour before my workout and I wanna have it finished about 30 minutes before my workout. And then I'm just sipping water throughout my workout and I mix the creatine and the BCAAs in. Um, towards the end of my workout, shake it up. About 15 minutes later, my workout's done. That's when I drink it. And that's what I have in my bag, guys. So um, just wanted to share that with everyone. I know uh, golfers, we love talking about what's in our golf bag, but I want to share what's in my gym bag with you. So that way maybe you can add a couple of these things in that'll help you um, in the gym.